In a country like ours, where bikes are advertised as definitely male and women on bikes is acceptable only if it's a secret agent movie, we have a group with us that has a different notion of biking. Meet Chennai's first bikers gang for women. They are shattering the gearless scooter for women image and racing off on trips on a 350cc Royal Enfield. It's been three months since they first met at a bike rally. They were the only women bikers amidst 100 other bikers from all over the city. Preetika, who does sales for Network 18 when she's not cruising on a Thunderbird, tells us the interesting story of this group's inception. Chennai Trucking Club CTC and uh, Rotary International got together for a blood awareness campaign uh, which uh, started from Chennai to Elegiri and back to Chennai. So that's where I got to meet Ella and Gayatri, female co-riders. Ella was riding a Lightning and Gayatri was riding a Pulsar, I was riding a Thunderbird. I mean it was a very nice feeling and that's where we thought okay we should start a group where you know all of us go for a ride. So that's the birth of Cruising Dames. Sure enough, these women create quite a stir on the roads when they ride together. A dame manoeuvring a royal enfield on busy streets with absolute ease is not an usual sight. But this doesn't deter these girls from long trips, open highways or off-road adventures. In fact, they quite enjoy the idea of having set a new trend. For Gayatri, a Bharatanatyam dance use on a bike, it all began with a ride alone on her father's bullet. It's not a very conventional thing to see ladies on bikes and uh, I hailing from a family which is very passionate about automobiles, obviously my curiosity towards it was there. And uh, But yeah, back home uh, they did have a lot of inhibitions in sending me for biking trips and that's when this cruising dames came and when they could see other females who could really go on long bike drives, uh, they thought okay why not just send me also to it. And I really thank the Cruising Dames to, for giving me such a nice opportunity and since then it has uh, been a really a very enjoyable experience with them. This group is now attracting women bikers from all over the city. Girls from varied professional backgrounds don a helmet and go full throttle only out of pure passion for bikes. After having kick-started a new trend in Chennai, Ella Johar, the leader of Cruising Dames, tells us the adventures these girls have in the lineup. The future of Cruising Dames, we are looking forward for more bike trips. We are looking to make females more aware that they can also do biking. The main purpose of finding a Cruising Dames is to aware the girls that they can also do it. Thunderbird is not just for males, Bullet is not just for males, it's for everyone. That's what we are spreading as an awareness. Also, we are looking forward for many bike trips all together. Next year, we are planning for Kartungla Pass, which is the highest road in the world, which is around approximately 18,000 meters up. And that's what we are targeting it. All of us together there. And then we are looking for nice bike trips on off-roading in Nagri and somewhere where we can do some off-roading and hardcore. So that's what Cruising Names is going to go. Three months and seven members young, these girls have set their sights on a long road ahead. Zipping past milestones and surprised onlookers, it has been a very nice journey since their first bike rally. Surely, there are many more open highways and narrow passes to conquer before they can rest. So if you happen to spot these girls at a Royal Enfield store or snaking their way through the traffic on a bike thrice their weight, don't be shocked. 
this trend is here to stay. Women and their successful journeys, there's more of that on the other side.